Hello and welcome everyone. In this video, I'll show you builds and tips for the wizard. The first build is for those who prefer to play as the co-star. The second build is for those who don't prefer to play as the co-star. And the third build is for XP farming. We are using in the first build. Super Savior, use jump and abilities while reviving. Elder Alchemist, start all I had regen with C elixir. Two-headed dragon, extend cost duration when you or ally carrier earns a vanquish. Viosa, cause an explosion at your feet when using spell disaster. Wandwamu, increase ammo capacity for abracadabra and shooting star. Elder Alchemist, start ally health regen with C elixir. Viosa, leveling up. And hard target. Two-headed dragon. Any vanquish or share vanquish by you or your carrier will extend the cost star duration. If both of you got a vanquish and share vanquish on the same zombie, even two share vanquishes on the same zombie, the extend duration then will be multiplied. Elder Alchemist. This will make you or other zombies who are affected by the Z elixir to start regenerate health almost instantly. The thing that makes this upgrade very powerful is the fact that you can't get damage while you regenerate health. So you will always get some health back when you use the Z elixir. Wanduamu. This will increase the amount of ammo you have by 4. Viosa. This will add 40 more damage for any plant that stand near you when using spell disaster. The first build is made to be as best as possible for the costar. The number one way to use it is by staying as the costar as much time as you can and try to get as much benefit from your build. And it depends on how difficult or how easy that is going to be. To make it easy on yourself, try to link to the best player that is available on your team or anyone that is above rank 300. If there is no one above that rank on your team, then it is better to switch to another build. Best characters to link with are the scientists because of the great mobility that you will be getting and super brains because it is very powerful combo. If you have a decent friend at the game, ask him to join you as super brains with his legendary upgrade equipped. Then use this build, link to him and enjoy the result. The second build however is not meant to be for costar fans. So if you are not a fan of the costar, then this is your build. The upgrades that we have here are for giving you a better defense because of the Osa upgrade and also offensively better because of Wandwamu upgrade and also having Z elixir upgrade to improve the 1v1's chances of winning. Great build overall and definitely worth a try. My general impressions about the wizard, he seems like to be a support and offensive character at the same time, a fun character to play as, very powerful too, and effective in every game mode. His upgrades are decent too, and his abilities won't leave you behind. His elixir ability is great to protect you from the most devastating abilities in the plant side, as you can completely protect any zombie from getting swallowed by the chumper. If you throw the elixir on the chumper just before the swallow animation is finished. The spell disaster ability is amazing at defeating nightcaps and his most unique ability, the costar, is to give the carrier some resistance to damage and to help him with his fights. Some people prefer to not use the costar, but I think the costar is stronger than the wizard by himself. That's it for this video. If you found it helpful, hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. That was ABC. See you in the next video.